my name is Erica Resch, I'm 25 years old and I am the co-founder of Breast Intentions. So I started Breast Intentions back when I was 15 after my mom was diagnosed with stage 3C breast cancer and within six months I saw two of my aunts also diagnosed with breast cancer. So I was surrounded by all of this stuff and I wanted to do something to help. My cousin and I were in a tent, 3 a.m., came up with this crazy idea, you know, why don't we just start our own charity? That way we know where the money's going and we can tell other people where the money's going. And that's how Breast Intentions was born. Breast Intentions is a uh, crisis intervention charity and we help women who have been diagnosed with breast cancer either financially or emotionally. We help um, with everyday things ranging from mortgage payments to electric bills, you know, lymphedema sleeves, wigs if they can't afford wigs, even transportation to and from treatment. Initially we started out, you know, just selling candy at church or soccer games. We started with um, a black tie gala. We've been able to expand into three other states, uh, Illinois, Massachusetts, and New York. Uh, we've raised over a million dollars since inception and helped thousands of families and even featured by the Yankees on field. They uh, were able to honor us and provide a donation. My mom is completely cured. <laughs> She's a survivor. Um, I believe it's 10 years coming up on 11 years soon and both my aunts are fine as well. I saw firsthand, you know, if we didn't have great health insurance, it'd be really hard just to manage the day-to-day -day bills. So I wanted to be able to help women, you know, focus on getting better rather than if they're gonna have a hot shower or putting food on the table. For the future, it might be funny, but uh, I kind of hope Breast Intentions is put out of business and we don't have to be there and we're not needed. But until then, I hope we can expand to have a footprint in every state and be able to help women, you know, just focus on getting better and they should have a calm state of mind when they're going through treatment so they can really put 110% into beating the disease.